Thursday things we're making Thursday things we're making Thursday yeah things we're making Thursday things we're making Thursday things we're making Thursday yeah welcome it's things we're making Thursday <laughs> it is that time of the week again if you do not know what things we're making Thursday is it is a year long collaboration that was started by a group of content creators. Um, you do a new pattern every month and it is always a free pattern that they choose and anybody can um, access that pattern. We, we give that pattern out every month. Um, anyone can join us. Um, if you don't have a channel and you wanna join us, you can contact any of the content creators um, they will be happy to share your pictures. You can join the Facebook group, which I will have linked below in the description box. Um, and if you do have a channel, you just update your progress once a week on Thursdays. Um, you can either go on and make a video or you can even use your community tab. Um, this is supposed to be a stress stress free not stressful <laughs> stress free fun group project everybody's stuff their patterns all turn out different um one person will use a different size yarn than another person and different colors and we all come up with these very very creative projects um, that are very different off of using the same pattern um now, I would like each of you guys to go and check out these other content creators. They're all listed in the des description box below, like I said before. Um, you can go watch their videos, like their videos, subscribe to them if you like what you see. And while you're at it, please hit that like button on my channel on this video and go and subscribe. Come back and watch all my other videos or Friday. <laughs> it's things we're making uh, Thursday on a Friday again because I am really, really good at this being behind stuff. So how is everybody doing? It's been another week. Plus, <laughs> um, we are making progress. All of us, I think. Um, I would say we. I don't know who we is. We, me and the little mouse in my pocket. Me and my dogs, I don't know. Hey, what are you two doing? Um, so, I am a mess, a mess here. Um, so, the raffia hat. Two different kinds of raffia I'm working on. Um, let me show you the one that I started first and kind of put off to the side because I wanted to try the other one. Um, so far, now, mind you, I have not gotten super far on either of these. Um, I've been having to take care of some family stuff and my garden and my dogs and myself. Well, kind of myself. So this is the thinner raffia. This is the one that I showed you guys. <laughs> The sandpaper on my hands, not that the other one is any better. It's not. Um, I like this one. Um, I like the stuff, the stitch definition better on it. Let's see if we can, um, you know, that's pretty close up. And I know it's very airy as it's supposed to kind of be. I think this Ravia yarn is probably not what is intended for this pattern, but I still like it better. Um, I think this is definitely... I'm not so sure I like, yeah, it's easier to work with actually than the other one, um, in my personal opinion. Um, I really want to start a third one with cotton. These are going actually probably much slower than they would be if um, it wasn't raffia. I mean, working with this stuff is not easy. Um, it's stiff. It is, my stitches are taking me much longer than um, they would with any other yarn. I want to um, 
make some with some cotton. I am going out of town next week or this coming week. Um, on Wednesday, we're going on a little camp out for like five days, a, a little family camp out. I'll be bringing my stuff with me to finish what I haven't. And I'm hoping because I can't do a lot of the physical outdoor activities that are usually done with my family. Um, I'm not left out by any means. Don't get me wrong. Um, I just can't physically do some of the stuff. So I'm going to work on my crochet stuff. I, I always bring my crochet stuff to work on when I'm up there. So I'll do, I'm going to, well, hopefully by next week, I'll actually have these two completed and a third one. So the other raffia yarn that I have is, you know, this wider ribbon type yarn. Um, as you can see, much, much thicker. Um, but it is ribbon type paper. It just folds over on itself as you work with it anyways. So it, it bunches up. Let me see if I can get a close up of how it folds over on itself. You know, it is thicker, but it's still, you know, it thins out and crumples as you work with it. You know, you can see, um, and I do, you know, I am much further along on this one with my little bun up there. It's not going to, it's not going to work as all I'm going to do is mess up my hair and, you know, um, I am using a different size hook. I am using an I nine, which is a five and a half millimeter with a thicker. I am using, I went down to an H hook, five millimeter, um, for the thinner one, I'll probably have to put more rounds in the thinner one because it's not going to fit over the top of the head otherwise. But, um, I, I love the pattern. I think the raffia yarn may not be the best use, um, for it. <laughs> I've seen a lot of other cotton ones and I have some cotton yarn that I have in mind that I am going to use. I believe there's enough. I actually didn't check to make sure there was enough of the this cotton yarn that I have, but I have another color that I can mix in with it. Yeah, there might not quite be enough. So I might have to use, um, maybe just do like a row right above the brim of this color when I do it. Cause I want, I want something a little more colorful than brown and gray this time, if I'm gonna use the cotton got tons of cotton yarn. This isn't my only ones, but oh, I don't know. This is pretty, pretty high end cotton to be using for a hat. But I like the colors. <laughs> hmm. What to do, what to do. I don't know. I'll decide. You guys will see if not next week. I'm hoping next week. I really hope that I can get some done um, of the cotton one next week as well. Um, but we'll see. It might not be until the following week, actually, because we leave Wednesday. So my time camping will be after Wednesday, which doesn't leave me much time to start anything else. So um, anyways, I'm just rambling as usual. I'm just sitting here doing my, doing my stuff, getting calls in the middle of uh, my video. Um. So yeah, we will see you guys in a week. Um, have a great one. Bye-bye. And I don't know why I always say bye. Just, you know, go with it. I'm hanging up the phone with you because that's what it feels like because that's what I record. <laughs>